Hi everyone, this is Eileen Castellano. Welcome to my 21 day challenge. Ready to dive in to taking responsibility. Um, that's what today's segment is all about. Many times we're not willing to do that and we don't even realize how staying engaged in what the situation is, the problem is, um, trying to prove our point, trying to convince the other person not to judge us, not to be mean or not to be cruel with us. We stay so stuck in that space, in that position, that it makes us hard to feel any sense of freedom, even if we're not with that person anymore. And so part of this 21 day challenge and finding the way of going to the higher vibration and staying in this higher vibration means that you're aware that you're doing this, that you're aware that this is happening to you, and what are you willing to do to remove that from your life and remove that from your um, thoughts and intentions and emotions so that you can be really free to just be you. So think about the times where you have felt that somebody, somehow you had a situation with someone and they, they made you feel responsible. They made you feel accountable. They made you feel like it was all your fault, right? A lot of times in relationships or or when we're in arguments with somebody or we have a, a certain conflict, somehow we end up allowing ourselves to feel guilty and then, you know, what could I have I done better or different? Or, you know, why, why are they saying that I did that? Did I really do that? And we stay festering in that, in that emotion. We stay festering in that idea that there's a possibility that we did something awful. And all I'm telling you today is I'm not, I'm not asking you to pretend whether you did or you didn't. That's not what we're here to do. I'm here to allow you and give you permission to take responsibility. Just take accountability. Yeah, you know what? You probably weren't your best. Yes, you probably weren't um, responding in the best way possible. There is a possibility that you were mean or you said mean and cruel things. And when we get to accept that we did, it's like, okay, so I did, you know, it was a bad moment. I had a tantrum. Um, I wasn't at my best. I let them get the better part of me and I took my power and just threw it away. And so when you accept that that's all it was and you're not so hard on yourself and you're not hooked in your mind, right? We think these things over and over again. And hi, Olga. Hi, Yoyi. Hi, Maritza, Monica, Marilyn. Leah, thank you for joining me today. When we're in this space of allowing someone else to, to just keep us in that place because of the words that they used or how they judged us or how they made us feel about the situation, we have two opportunities here. We have one, which is to stay in the, in the, in the guilt, in, in the victim consciousness, look what's happened to me, how horrible, I'm, I'm destroyed, right? And every time that we say, I am, I am something, we, we totally own it. So we want to be really careful that we don't say that, that I am destroyed, or I am terrible, or I am an awful person, or I am guilty, or because there's nothing in that. It's just a perception that you have taken and made a reality. And so I'm telling you today, all you've got to do is take responsibility, which is the second option. Just take responsibility. Yes, I was horrible. Yes, I didn't do so good. Yes, I had a tantrum. Yes, it's, it's okay. I, I had one of those moments. I had an episode. <laughs> I love using that word, episode. I had an episode, right? Like we watch on TV. There's, you know, different episodes. We had a moment. We had a condition. And that's it. And that's it. If we can say, I had and I did, and yes, I take full responsibility, that's your freedom. Because the other person can't keep you engaged anymore, which is a lot of what happens in relationships when people want to keep us engaged. That's how they get our attention. Even if it's not positive attention, even if it's negative attention, it's attention. And even if the emotions that we're sharing are not about love and understanding and compassion, but it's anger and resentment and rage, it's still an emotion. And you still stay emotionally connected and emotionally attached to that situation. So I'm encouraging you all today, take responsibility. Just say, yes, yes, I did it. Yes, it was me. Yes, that was me. Yes, I did. I did. I truly did. And then you let it go. 
and then you step into your freedom and then you realize that there's so much more beyond that space beyond that point beyond that individual beyond that relationship that you're ready to really move in and move on and that is what stepping into greatness is all about that is what high vibrational living is all about is you get to look at things for what they are we tend to create a lot more than they really are just because we're trying to make sense of things. But some things are senseless. Some things don't make sense. And they just happened. And, and, and they are what they are. And we take responsibility to free ourselves, to free our soul. Remember, in this all-in ascension program, this 21-day challenge that you're doing, it's all about stepping in to this high vibrational space, moment, episode, lifestyle, living, experience so that you can continue on this journey of being on purpose. Loving yourself means that you free yourself. Loving yourself means that you accept all that you've been, all that you've done, the good, the bad, the ugly. It's all, it's all in it for a reason. It's all in our lives for a reason. And we get to learn from it and we get to grow from it and we get to evolve so that we are in this high vibrational lifestyle. I love you all. Thank you so much for your love and your support. Have an amazing and amazing day. Again, I will be back tomorrow at 12. We're wrapping up our 21-day challenge. And so happy to be here with you today. And I know that for all of you doing the work, because I get emails, I get little text messages, I get IMs just telling me how much their lives are changing and how everything is aligning to what they really want. So again, keep those coming. Thank you for sharing. You can go on my website, EileenC.com, for more information on the different programs that I offer. And you can also sign up on YouTube and subscribe and share with people that you love, that you know, we're, we're, that you know are going to benefit from this information. Love you all and have a great day. Thank you.